What does it mean to be an American essay? What is an essay? An essay is a professional paper discussing a particular subject and comprises an introduction, body, and conclusion. So, what should you include in these three sections? Introduction. Highlight the topic you want to discuss. Offer background information so that your reader may understand the context. End with a thesis statement. This statement shows the subtopics that your essay will cover. Body. Provide key arguments or points together with their analysis offer evidence if needed. Some essays need more pieces of evidence than others. For instance, expository essays will likely have more than narrative essays. Each paragraph should start with a topic sentence and discuss one point. Every paragraph must connect to the thesis, conclusion, restate your thesis, connect core points, show the significance of the topic. You can learn more about how to write an essay and also how to format an essay, which we have explored in deep. Which type of essay do you use for this topic? Many types of essays exist, such as expository, narrative, and argumentative. You should know the best type to use when authoring your essays, or you can use a mixture. This section will explain two of the most common essay types used to discuss what it means to be an American. The two essay types are expository and narrative. What is an expository essay? An expository essay is a paper that offers a clear, focused description of a subject. This is the most written essay, so you will frequently come across it in your academic life. The subject can be an idea or concept. Some scholars put a descriptive essay as a subtype of expository writing. In this case, your expository essay can discuss topics around objects, places, and people. The other subtypes of an expository essay accepted by all scholars include process essay, cause and effect essay, problem and solution essay, compare and contrast essay, what is a narrative essay. The narrative essay is a paper that explains a story. The story is mainly from a personal point of view, though in some instances, it can be an imaginative exploration. This essay type demands you to wear your creative hat to create an engaging, well organized story. A narrative essay should not always follow the nitty-gritty items of an essay structure. It is not a must for you to have all three broad parts, introduction, body, and conclusion. However, you ought to start by setting up the story and end by stating the importance of the story you may mention the impact the narrative has had on you or what you learned from your experience, or writing the essay. Now that you know what an essay is and the type to use when discussing the topic, Let's proceed to the next section, which is understanding the meaning of an American. What is American according to the dictionary? An American, according to the Merriam-Webster dictionary, is an inhabitant or native of any of the countries in the American continent. Another definition offered by this dictionary is that an American is something related to America. Going by these definitions, when you write what means to be an American, you can write about anything that connects with America. The examples below will help you better understand what you can discuss about being an American. Examples of texts that answer what it means to be an American, we have gathered several pieces of text from the internet that talk about what it means to be an American. These examples will show you the topics you can use in your essay, as well as the angles and tactics to incorporate to have an outstanding piece. Example, in my view, being an American means being free. You can live where you want, marry who you wish, and work anywhere. It also means being proud of America and believing that everything will prosper. Being an American also means that you support troops fighting for our nation. In case of a disaster, you should offer assistance as much as possible. Also, being an American means you treat others with respect. Five steps of writing What does it mean to be an American today? Essay, now that you have seen what people are discussing about what does it mean to be an American, what steps can you take when writing an essay of this kind? The steps are as follows. Step 1. Brainstorm ideas. The first step you should take is to decide on the ideas you will discuss in your essay. The ideas of being an American you can discuss include the following, but are not limited to them. The ideals of America, your freedoms and rights have been respected, the opportunities you have 
your profession, like being a service member, your life as an inhabitant, the role you have played in making America great. Some focus on one idea in their essay, while others incorporate more than one idea. You can pick the style that fits best to you. In selecting the ideas, choose the one that greatly relates to you or one that you have a good understanding of. You can write down these six ideas and the points you have under each. Then choose the one with many points. Take your time in this step. Start thinking about the ideas as soon as you receive the assignment, or you read this part. Step 2. Form an outline. Once you have settled on the ideas, create an outline. An outline simplifies the essay writing process, as you will know what to write in which section. So, try to make a detailed outline. Mention what you will touch on in every paragraph. You may start by broadly dividing the outline into three parts introduction, body, and conclusion. In the above section, we explained what to include under each of these parts. After creating these three broad divisions, come up with a thesis and list what you will discuss in the body section. Step 3. Create a thesis statement. The third phase is to craft a thesis statement. The thesis statement should touch on all aspects you will discuss in the body section. Examples of theses you can use based on the ideas presented in step 1 include the following. Thesis statement 1. The American ideals assist individuals in realizing the American dream in terms of profession and being happy. Points you can talk about in the body paragraph that relate to this thesis are, what is the American dream? How Americans have achieved their professions by utilizing the ideals? How have American ideals fostered happiness among the citizens? Thesis statement 2. My life as an inhabitant has been smooth as my basic rights have been protected. Points to mention under the body using this thesis include features of your smooth life, the specific rights that have been positively affected. Step 4. Draft the essay. After following the above steps, you can start writing the essay. You can write the essay using whichever style you see fit. As stated above, many who have written about your topic have utilized a narrative or expository essay or combined both styles. In the narrative essay, they describe their personal experiences, such as telling about their life in America or how America has provided them with many opportunities. In expository, they discuss other people, objects, or concepts. For instance, they may mention how the American ideals and constitution promote basic human rights. Step 5. Proofread. The last step is to proofread your work. Use the strategies below to proofread your essay effectively. Go on a break, then come back with fresh eyes. Tell a friend or family member to review the work for you. Use grammar and spell check tools, like Grammarly. Look for common errors such as syntax spelling and grammatical. You can use some forms of repetition in this essay, such as the phrase being an American. What are the tips you can use when writing a what it means to be an American essay? The general tips are, ensure clarity is at its best. Avoid using complex words and long sentences. Avoid passive voice. If you use a narrative style in any part of the content, you may do the following. Do not explain every specific detail of your personal experiences. For example, demonstrating each movement you made while going somewhere, limit references, avoid as much as possible using second-person narratives, such as greatly using you. Suppose you incorporate an expository writing style in a particular section or the entire essay. In that case, you may use one or different subtypes of this essay such as a process style, compare and contrast style, or cause and effect style. For instance, you may explain a specific American process, compare and contrast American policies with another nation, or how a specific aspect of cause has affected you effect. Dot, in a nutshell, to write what it means to be an American essay, you will need to learn the different essay types and read several samples to understand the basics. Afterward, Follow the five steps highlighted above to write the essay. You can use a mixture of different essay writing styles in your paper.